Thanks, Fiona. Hello, you're watching Wales Today. I'm Nick Savini. Christmas is often an expensive time of year and the cost of living crisis is really biting for some people in need. The MP Carolyn Harris says there's been more demand than ever for free Christmas hampers for the charity she's involved with in the Swansea area. But she says the project has already cost £14,000 more just to match what they bought last year as part of the Everyone Deserves a Christmas scheme. Nicola Smith reports. Plenty of festive spirit in Swansea Market as the community joined together to launch this year's Christmas hamper scheme. Since 2017, with donations from the public and local businesses, people in the city have been gifted a Christmas dinner. People like Andrew, who needed a little extra help last year. When your priorities change, then you need to think then, hang on, do I need to pay the rent, do I pay the electric, do, or do I just buy have a basic dinner, do I have a tin of soup or something? Whereas when I had the hamper last year, it did actually make such a huge difference that I was able to actually invite a friend to come and, uh, and have Christmas dinner with me, who was in exactly the same situation as me. And it turned out to be one of the best Christmases I've had in a very, very long time. This was the scene back in 2020, as more than 100 volunteers packed up the Christmas hampers in a bingo hall. 1,000 were made up then, and two years on, demand is growing. This year, they'll reach families in Neath and Port Talbot too. And whilst requests don't normally come in until late October, they started in May. We've had families emailing saying, we can't afford food and um, toys, so can you help us? I've already placed an order for the food for the hampers, and it's costing us £14,000 more this year just to, to match what we did last year. So and we will be ordering more food. So the cost of living is hitting everyone. Back in Swansea Market, the collections continue to ensure a little Christmas spirit reaches as many people as possible. Ronwen Lewis, thank yeah. you very much. Thank you.